Hello friends, welcome to the video number 9 of the Excel 2016 series and well this is going to be a pretty short video so I want to take the advantage to make a small announcement or some promotion I'm very happy because today I sold my first uh, soft cover book in, in Amazon's Kindle so if you haven't heard about it well I just want to make a little bit of promotion so I have here the Spanish version, or here I have the English uh, version. You can come here to Amazon, then to Kindle Store, and look at it. Uh, look for it as, as we say in Mexico. It's a compilation of 308 popular saying, uh, sayings, phrases, and expressions that we use here in Mexico. And I added a, a small uh, interpretation of each one. So I hope you find it. Uh, well, entertaining and, and fun, and also maybe can be kind of a guide for you if you have heard some of these popular sayings and don't know what they mean, well, maybe you can you can find it here. So, okay, that's it for, for my promotion. Let's go back to Excel. And well, how to access the ribbon by only using the keyboard and without having to use my mouse. Uh, some people find these kind of shortcuts uh, very useful to be uh, like to be more productive or, or to be faster on Excel or basically on any other program that you are uh, working on. So it's pretty simple. The only thing you need to do is to press the Alt key on your keyboard. So I'm going to do it right now. And as you can see, I got these numbers and letters added. So for example, if I want to go to the backstage, I can press the F key. Then I want to open a new one so I can press N and then I can select uh, a new uh, a blank workbook or a template, whatever I I want to. So I'm gonna press Escape twice to go back to to the worksheet of Excel. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna press H to go to the Home tab, and I want to apply a bolt to the cell B2. So I'm gonna press one. And there it is. I know that some of you might be already thinking, well, it's better for me to use the Control B shortcut. Well, again, I just wanted to show you a different way for achieving the same result. So you can just choose uh, whatever you like the best. Uh, another thing, for example, here, well, I'm gonna go here to A1. I'm, pre I'm gonna press Alt, then I'm going to go to Data, so I'm gonna press A. And then I press T, and then I have my filters added. So there you go. You, I, I guess you get the idea. That's pretty much what you need to do. Just press the Alt key on your keyboard and then follow by uh, pressing the numbers or the letters that you need to get whatever you want. Uh, so, well, that's pretty much about it for this video. Again, uh, thanks all of you for watching. If you like the video, please go ahead and Click that like button and share the video with your friends. If you haven't already subscribed, then I invite you again to subscribe to the channel. And well, that's it for now. Thanks all of you for watching and I'll see you on the next video.